guys welcome back to railroads online now today we're taking this massive snaky train down to the well the new area isn't it the, the refinery the oil field and the ironworks so the first thing we need to do is get these two down to the bottom now this train's parked here so we can't go here so we have to go around to the new bit of track and down uh, we can do that we can do that Okay, so what we gotta do is basically get these down to the end and then the mogul can pick them up. I think what I'll do, I'll, I'll cut to the point where the mogul can pick them up then. Right, it's been a little bit messing around here because I had to move this back and uh, then you guys would tell me off if I drove the mogul backwards. So I had to take around the Y, which is why the points are now wrong and there should be enough space to get me back there now this time. Right, I've gone and checked all the brakes and everything. Uh, do we need anything on here? Probably a good idea to actually put some wood on. Bets is moving, which means everything else must be moving. I take that down a bit. Just stop it being so jerky. The actual. I think we can ease on the power. Let's ease on the power. Do you see that? It hit something. It's rather strange, that. Just got to get over... Well, it's effectively over the bridge where we really got to get over. I 
I think it's trying to work out the amount of carriages we've got. Make this into a video by itself, this. Now we are going downhill now, but half the train's still going up here, I think. I'm pretty sure I'm on full power, I am. I could put the reverse up a bit more. Had to be that one, didn't it? Um prefer you not to do this, please. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You can't actually use a little bit of Betsy. It's a little help, a little help, sort of push up a bit. Okay. These are about to break. Okay, reverse will do that. That we do that. Brakes, we slow it off. It still wants to go off though. Um, we think, and we think, and we think, and we think. This is the junction to. We have to. S yeah, this train needs to go to right. The rest of the train has to go left. Okay, that's fine. Fine, that's what we intended it to do. Alright, I'll go up and detach, then we'll carry on. Right, I've detached half the train, the bit which isn't going with us. Points are set. Betsy's brakes are back on. Hopefully, it's going to hold everything. Great tray now. So I didn't put the, the brakes on those, did I? Oh dear. I feel what? It's fairly flat here. Should be fine. We're interested to see how much oil we can actually make. I'm betting this is too far away. Um. 
like that. Strange. That's doing it. <laughs> you annoying thing. I think you have to open it from here. Then, do you open it from here? You do. So how do you know... I just wasted some because of that, didn't I? Right, I've reloaded. I have an idea. We use the back one. We bring this round, switch it on. Then we use this one. And we do it very, very, very slowly. Right, so that's inside. We're now gonna turn this on a bit. What do you think? Nine percent? How easy is it to find the uh on this side? You still have to go down that way. at all the way this is done I wish it would be auto stop or something just to help you so while I'm messing around with trying to get three Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Got to be twelve, right? God, I hate the hitbox for this. It's terrible. 12. Now we had 18, so we have 6. We did, we haven't lost any. <clears throat> now, we should go and get the train. Alright, I saw the video. We're, I wander back up, go and get the. Uh, I say wander back up. I should bring the train round and go and attach it to that, and we'll put some more wood in. We've got nine, uh, twelve, 
15, 18, so it's three, isn't it? It's not much deciding to put, really. Actually, money's good, because we, if we want to get that last, another engine, for the last journey, then this will, it should help us, really, shouldn't it? We probably want to get a third one of these, really. I'll do one job on camera and I'll do one job after. Okay, what I was really interested in is here, is to see if we can actually get past the train in both directions here. So we want to go down there and be able to get all the way around, maybe there and out again. I think for now we'll just leave this here. All right, we're going to wander up to uh, Betsy. Now she's going to have to shunt a few things now because she's at the end of the train. But well, we made it here. It's quite, it's quite a way actually, isn't it? Right, let's check how much uh, she's got no fuel. Okay, can we fill her up? Now, we're going to have to take this very slowly because we've got two places to go. These two will go down to the ironworks, or need to, and these, these, what is it, six? What have I got there? Five, six, five, I think, need to go up to the refinery. Now, I'm not sure it made it to the video when I was setting this up, but I was umming and ahhing about whether I should try and get Betsy to the front of this set so we wouldn't have to pull it. But it was the difficulty of actually setting that up, which is why we didn't do that. Now, someone was saying if you turn the re reverser down a bit, you use less fuel. I'm okay with that, we'll try that. I've been messing around with the reverser anyway for the last uh, few days. I think it goes left slightly, then it gets to the junction. Well, I don't think we need to go up, take these all the way up. So I think we do leave this at the junction because then when we take the oil up there, we then we just push them up as well. Whatever happens, we're gonna have to push them up. Ooh. Now I think this junction's probably gonna be wrong. So we stop and we're gonna check it. Mm, we're actually fine on this one. So that's the exit to the uh, oil field. It's the next one. We can physically see the next one's going the wrong way. So we do need to stop on that one. Now I think we probably have to, to go in the input and go around the new track. So we're we doing that. We need to get these in front of us when we actually, uh, I hope, should be sufficient. Is it? Yes, just. Good. If we had more coal, we could make more of these. But to do more coal, as we've talked about, you need so many other things. Okay, we're around the other end. Let's get this brake off again. Oh, 
Right, we're nearly here. That's it. Right, well, yes, here we go then. The short little journey to, uh... yeah, this is where you, you have to actually go forward. Isn't that a sight, yeah? I think that's a great sight. Right, so we can make some more now. We have to wait a moment now. I think we've got to get to nine, haven't we? If you can get nine, it can only hold 18. Doesn't matter, we can still move everything forward. Yep. We can do this one. Yes, we can do this one. Hurry up, come on. It's an empty train. We could reverse it straight back where we were. No benefit for it leaving it here. All right, I'm gonna do that. I'll do that off the camera. Now, just drop me. We can probably leave these ones here for a moment. Just outside. We take Betsy back down, do a run around, and then put Betsy the other side of the oil, and then we connect the oil to this train. Then we end up going back to the, uh, the ironworks. We fill the pipes up again, and we take that to the refinery, the oil and the pipes to the refinery. Now we want to fill this one up. How much have we got now? We've got 24. 
Now, can we see the actual main amount from here? No, you can't. Could we see the main amount from here? We could, but not then looking down. And also, it's not. What I'm trying to work out is an easier way to load this, rather than having to scout to see if we've got the 12 on there. Because if we knew, if we could see this, we've got 24. Obviously, when it goes down to 12, that would be done. But the hitbox for this is terrible. Well, I'm aiming it now. Please don't do it too fast. One. Yeah. So if we've done it right, we've left with, we're left with 12 up here. We are. So we've not lost any this time. We're getting good at this now. We've learned how to do it. So switch this one on slightly. Then switch these ones or this one on to control it. And the little run between these little things are far better for a little tank engine. Because of course we didn't make it quite. Is it? We're here. Now we're going to fill these three up again. Right, so we're, we've loaded. We've, we're not going to take those with us because we don't need them. We're going to head around this way and hopefully then go and pick up that lumber. Full fuel, but the verse correct, break off, and off we go. So if we need more oil though, we can make a little bit more. I think we do have a few more pipes left. I don't think we would make very much fight or if I'm honest. But as long as we can make one car's worth. Then the challenge is complete. There it is. It's funny. It's what 38, 39 episodes of this? Plus lots of work in the uh, in the background. And it's nearly done. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> 
think it might be prudent, actually. Mm, it's probably fine. But we need to let pipes run anyway. I was going to let the... Uh, in fact, I am going to let the, uh, the wood off before we actually get to the junction. So we've got nine of 100. We could drop the pipes off. Right, so we've got nine, so it should take us to 18. Okay, so we didn't lose any. So this is for next episode. We can't unload on here. I don't think we can load on this one. We will be able to load on this one because I've made sure that's pretty straight. So that's what we're going to be doing next episode. And then we will be making refined oil. How much will we make? We've got 24 oil. Depends what the ratio is. I don't know what it is. And I'm not looking. I don't want you guys telling me either. I want, I want the surprise. So we've got 36 of those. We've got 24 of those. We've got more if we need it. Fantastic. And that's where we're going to leave it. Um, I do hope you enjoyed. Um, yes. Next episode is the last one in this series. But, uh, it's been very enjoyable, hasn't it? But uh, thank you very much for watching. If you did enjoy it, please press the like button. If you want to see more, please subscribe and you press that ding-dong bell button. You know what it does. See you next time. Bye-zee-bye. -bye.